By this time tomorrow, we should know whether mandatory water restrictions will be put in place. The state water board is set to vote on the restrictions when it meets. Violating them would lead to a $500 fine. One regulation would force hotels to offer guests the option not to have towels and bed sheets washed on a daily basis. Up until now, conservation has been voluntary. Well, that decision comes amid a new round of dire predictions about California's water supply because by every measure, the drought just keeps getting worse. Lots of water, not so much water. We're right down there. If the governor's warnings haven't scared you into shorter showers, how about this headline in the LA Times? A NASA scientist using sophisticated satellite imaging says California is down to just one year's worth of water storage. The realization about how bad the drought is is beginning to sink in. Water expert Peter Glick doesn't exactly agree with that dire one-year prediction, but he's hardly optimistic. And the reality is we've drawn down over the last three years and now four years of drought our reservoir storage, we've overpumped our groundwater, our soils are dry. It's a collision of problems creating a drought unlike any we've seen before. In 76, 77, we have the worst two year drought on record, but we have we have almost twice the number of people in the state as we had at that point. Then there's climate change, which means drought combined with California's three warmest years on record. And that increases demand for water, increases loss of snow, increases loss of water from our reservoirs. Finally, we're managing all of this with largely 19th century infrastructure and 20th century water policies. And the results are catching up with us. Farmers wake up when they can't get irrigation water and they have to fallow their land. And that's already happening. Uh, consumers will wake up when their prices for food start to go up. Simply put, we're now in what is likely the worst drought in California history, with no end in sight. The truth is if we don't deal with the drought now, the pain is going to grow and grow, and we're going to have to put in place much more severe restrictions in the coming coming year. Well, according to that NASA study, California would need 11 trillion gallons of water to erase what is now a four-year drought.